the word Adam means man, and this word is made of a three essential Hebrew letters, the letter Aleph, the letter Dalet, and the letter Mem. The letter Aleph is the first letter and usually represents the Almighty, the Creator. He is one and He is supreme. So the letter Aleph symbolizes strength, oneness, and symbolizes the Creator. And then we have two letters, Dalet Mem, that when they get combined together, they form the word Dam, which means blood. So Adam is the fusion of a spirit and blood. That is where Adam is. We have the spirit of the Creator. We have the strength of the Creator. We have the inspiration of the Creator. But we also have a fleshly body with blood. We also have blood. We also have a physicality. At the beginning, we read in the Bible that the Almighty created Adam in his own image. So we see it very clearly in the name because we have Aleph and we have Dam, a spirit and blood. Being created in the image of the Almighty has nothing to do with a physical image. It has to do with a spiritual image, mercy, compassion, holiness, justice, righteousness, all of the attributes of the Almighty. So what's the difference between man and an animal is exactly this letter, that man has a soul a man can do justice, can do mercy, can do righteousness, can love others, can have compassion on others, can have a purpose in life, a prophetic destiny. Now animals don't have any of that. Animals just live the present. They eat, they go to sleep, they don't care about their children, their grandchildren. They, they cannot even process the meaning of prophecy or the meaning of destiny. They are hungry, they can just eat a rotten piece of meat on the side of the road and that's it. So that's what happens to Adam when Adam loses this spirituality. That's why there is so much chaos and wars and destruction in the world because a lot of humanity has detached themselves from the Creator. They have lost the spirituality. So when a human being loses the spirituality, it becomes an animal. But when Adam comes back to the Creator, we recover that Aleph, that is spirituality. And then we have a purpose and we have a destiny in life and we have the attributes of the Almighty. I hope that this message will bless you. Shalom and stay tuned for more Messianic News updates.